We're standing here with uh, Leonard Gates, uh, uh, the first time on the stage here in, in Europe at the, the World Series here in Amsterdam. How does it feel to, to, to play for such a big audience here in Amsterdam? Oh, man, it feels great because, um, uh, you know, I played this many stages over in America, mm -hmm. but, but to come over here and to play this game in front of where it all started, that's a, that's a different level. It's a different feeling. It's a different level. Um, and it's, you know what? I like it. I'm going to continue to do it. You know what I mean? <laughs> we know you as a top soft, soft tip player. Yes. Would you ever have thought to, to be at the top in, in, in steel tip as well? Well, slowly getting into the top. No, I haven't because a friend of mine back in San Antonio, Irene Medina, she wanted me, she said, hey, you need to play soft uh, steel tip. I was like, no, nah, those guys are too serious. You know, I'm going to stick with the soft tip and this and that. But uh, she convinced me to play. My first throws uh, of steel tip was a ton 40. I said, oh, yeah, I like this. I'm, I think I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to think I'm gonna do this some more. Yeah. <laughs> Lots of people um, will rec recognize you now, but yeah. they, they probably w wouldn't have known who Leonard Gates was. What do you do in the U.S.? Are you uh, a full-time darts player now or, or becoming one? Uh, I'm trying to, but at the same time, you know, I, I do deliveries during the week when I'm not uh, – uh, playing darts on the weekend or or wherever I go to go play darts, but not quite full time. But I, I still, you know, do my in between. You know what I'm saying? I gotta keep myself busy. Yeah. You know what I mean? But uh, if it get to that point where I can do it full time, trust me, I'm going. I'm diving in. You know what I mean? So Leonard Gates is going to be at Q School again. Yes, I'll be at Q School again. For sure. Um, one thing I I do like to talk about a lot is darts development in for example the united states and mm -hmm. um, we've seen those great efforts on the on the on the cdc tour yes do you think it's improving every year, single year the, the level of darts in the u.s oh yes it's definitely improving uh we got some guys that have been there in darts that have kind of slacked off but they're coming back and they're showing what they can do in the steel tip uh the cdc and and also the young the young guys joey lanow um uh peter stewart jr kaden anderson um, uh, Steph, uh, Seth Stefano, those guys are coming up and, uh, they, they have that drive to where it's going to keep USA darts or North American darts keep to, to keep going, you know? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And you are one part of, uh, the, the story of the North American darts now tomorrow, uh, James, uh, James Wade, James Wade. Oh good luck. My God. Yeah. I, I know, you know, James, uh, when we was in, uh, uh, Madison Square Garden, you know, we spoke and this and that. And, I'm, you know, this guy's laid back. And I'm just like, okay, yeah, you trying to set me up because I might have to play him in the future. Yeah, yeah. And tomorrow is the future, you know. Good luck, Leonard. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs>